video today we have special buy of the day automotive tools power tools hand tools accessories don't forget to help out the channel by subscribing hitting the like hitting the bell icon so we can buy more tools like this make more to review videos that's the way youtubers and platform by subscribers and likes so help out the channel by doing so all right let's go ahead and get started uh so special buy of the day uh automotive tools power tools hand tools accessories all right so um uh, automotive tools quick quick jack here 7,000 pound 1,000 $399 you got another one here is uh, $1,349 looks like just about the same rating uh, maybe a little different style uh, same thing with this one this is a 5,000 pound jack it's a great for brake jobs guys if you're doing you know brake jobs in the weekends and stuff like that uh, this is a really good jack to have uh, you got or maybe light duty suspension like suspension work this one's a really good deal on that, or really good uh, product. You got 5,000 uh, pound, quick jack, uh, 1,229. All right, this is my favorite posts. Uh, these, these, something like this is, 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 is what I would want in my ideal shop. Obviously, I don't have the room for it here, but this is what I would buy definitely. Um, this is probably the best. This is a 10,000 pound capacity, uh, two post car lift. Uh, 3,230 and then you got a 6,000 pound capacity portable mid-size two po post car lift uh, 2,100 so this is this one's pretty good um, it's a little bit less capacity is gonna be for your smaller vehicles maybe for these are for trucks now if you have a big truck or something like that or you're gonna have trucks you know might as well buy something like this uh, you got motorcycle lift 419 you got a uh, digital tire inflator 1588 all right you got a jump jumper start uh, power pack here 6000 ma lithium 2999 on these you really do have to look at the capacity here this one's a really small battery i think um i've i've i have i reviewed someone some that have 20000 ma and they are just awesome to have something like this is a little too small maybe for smaller engines for a four cylinder um it may be a v8 but still you know it's you might want to look at the crank cranking amps too the all those all those uh details on these uh you got 12 volt wheel automotive battery 109 uh you got 8000 lumen rechargeable flashlight with 10,000 um 89 that's probably the battery uh 89.99 you got a power station jump starter 99.99 i right, got a portable jump starter here see this is now you're starting to get into the the better ones uh so this is 10,000 ma 10,000 ma is pretty good it's a, it's a pretty good size um i wouldn't go below 10,000 ma to tell you the truth um 59.99 you got a, a an inflator here for ninety nine dollars. Does come with some, uh, an inflator and some uh, jump starter pack here, um, and just some accessories here. Some so, so nice. I gotta say a nice kit there for ninety nine bucks. That you can get this for cheaper. You probably can get this for cheaper if you you know buy them separate. You know if you have a tool a tool brand or a tool battery, chances are they already do an inflator like Ryobi and stuff like that. Uh, you got a 12 volt shelf automotive battery, 79.99. Got a 12 volt wheel uh, automotive battery. Uh, this these are chargers, by the way. I think yeah, they're chargers. 159. You got another jumper start pack, 57.99. Um, you got like I said, look at the MA on these. Um, you got 3.5 color inspection camera. Uh, 126. I I've reviewed a few inspection cameras. I guess the bigger thing is the 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 quality, the if it's HD and how big is the screen because you don't want to be looking through a really small screen on these. Um, digital entire inflator LCD pressure gauge, seventeen ninety nine. You got eight eight hundred amp. See, this is what you have to look. Eight hundred amp compact lithium portable jump starter and charger. Eighty nine ninety nine. I think this might be a little bigger battery there. Uh, you got digital inflator, $24.99. You got a, a lift floor jack, triple lift floor jack, 
184. And then you got a front wheel drive bearing remover, installer kit 119. A digital boroscope inspection camera 85. Looks small. So I don't know. You would have to look at the size, like I said. Make sure you guys look at the size of that screen. Because um, they even sell attachments for the cell phone. Like if you have a phone, they'll have like a, a, a attachment camera you guys could buy. You can probably search it online. 23-piece bar joint U-joint service kit 152. You got 1,500-pound engine leveler uh, handle, $45. Uh, you got a power. Oh, these are nice. Power built 4-ton or 4-inch. Yeah, 4-ton. Are these four ton or four inch? Yes, look like four ton. Yeah, they're four ton. Um, forty four dollars. You got that's pretty good deal for these, by the way. Uh, you got twenty two piece cooling system pressure testing. Uh, one sixty two for the radiators and stuff like that. All right, you got the uh, Bajoy service kit seventy seven bucks. You got uh, these are all sold out. All right, you got some power tools here. We got a lot of rigid. Uh, you got a joiner planer, $599. You got a table saw and a light, $428. Uh, you got a compact band saw kit with 4 amp hour battery, $189. I believe this is a brushed. Uh, you got, uh, what is this? Uh, one, yeah, this is the deal that we've seen at the stores, guys. Uh, I think this is a pretty good deal. Um, so definitely check it out. That 6 amp hour battery and the charger are you know, definitely worth the, the extra money over the bread tool. So this is the M12 fuel, 1.6 gallon lithium cordless wet and dry vac with the 6 amp hour battery and a charger and some accessories. Really nice vac. Uh, you got some overpriced uh, rigid here for $199. Uh, you got 10 inch job pro job site table saw. So there's two of them for $799. Alright, you got a nice kit here for the DIY uh it's okay it's not the best deal 289 you're getting two batteries uh, inflate this inflate is 20 bucks this one's uh 80 i seen it for like 89 bucks or something uh this one's 89 bucks and i haven't seen i don't know what the price on that one all right you got the 3 8 impact wrench 199 you got an angle grinder 159 i think it's a pretty good deal on that uh it is octane just to let you know uh, you got a grease gun here, 1.5 amp hour battery, uh, 159. You got an impact driver, subcompact, 159. Does come with three batteries? I guess it does. Plus battery included. Oh yeah, so they include an extra battery, I guess, with this kit. And then you got the drill driver here, uh, 109. So this is brushed. It doesn't say brushless. Crazy. Uh, this is Octane. This is brushless. I think I don't know what's happening to Bridget. Are they going downhill or like, you know, not downhill, but are they going down as in quality wise? Because all the Octane stuff was brushless and now they're bringing all this new stuff that's not even brushless. Isn't that crazy? Instead of going up, up in the world, they're going down. So uh, you got an Octane brushless cordless seven and a quarter circ saw 199. You got a 5 inch ramp over to sander, uh, 99 bucks. That's the kit. And you got a, what is this? One handed reciprocating saw, 159. Alright, here's the grease gun here. So I guess I guess that kit is worth it. The kit uh, that we saw on the top. Well, hold on. It's 159. Yeah, I guess this kit's worth it. It's pretty good. I didn't know the price on that, on that grease gun. All right, you got a router 149. It is uh, octane, octane brushless angle grinder 139, and then you got a drywall cutoff tool. Um, you got a drill here. We seen we seen these drills cheaper. And probably yeah, we seen this. See 159 is a pretty good deal here for for these. Well, if you're on the line, I guess it's a good deal. You got a fan in the in the speaker here for 99 bucks. You got a uh, I got these two. These two are pretty good. Uh, 159. I think we've seen them cheap. We, yeah. I think I think you can get them cheaper than this. If you guys do the, like wait for Christmas time. But if you need it, obviously this is not a bad price. This is probably one of the best prices around right now. 
All right, so we got a half an inch drill driver with two 1.5 ampere, $98. You got a drill and a light, 79 bucks. Not too bad, I guess, for the DIY. All right, you got some gear wrench mixed mini dual miter plier set, material plier set, my bad. $49.97. You got a hex SAE bit socket, 10 piece, $29.49. You got a 347 piece, $249. All right, so let's see here. We got three ratchets. Uh, I guess it's not a bad deal for eighty nine bucks. Um, but yeah, for eighty nine bucks, I I think you can get a more more complete kit unless you're just looking for the uh, universal, you know, for the extensions and the ratchets. Hold on, maybe there's more pictures to this. They always do this too. No, those are yeah. Just they just include the extensions and the universal yeah I guess if you're just looking for the ratchets that's a good deal for you all right this is uh this is a nice one uh SAE impact wrench bit socket set seven pieces 20 yeah these are nice to have sometimes you get your your you know those bolts or your those weird bolts that are hex and you have to take them off. Uh, I guess this is pretty good for a mechanic. Like I said, if you do w jobs on the weekends, that's a good. Uh, if you're a DIY, I guess if you want to have it. You got a home office essentials tool set, tool bag, 43 piece, 46, 45. You got a nice ba uh, backpack here, 31 pocket pro, 85 bucks. You got a nice uh, 31 pocket tech tool backpack, 64 bucks. I'm personally not a really, I'm not a fan of these. Um, these backpacks, I really, I like more bags, you know, tool bags. That's that's the way I. 18 pocket pro white mouth tool bag in black, 62 bucks. You got a backpack 53, uh, 17 inch. You got a 16 inch 14 pocket, uh, tool bag 30 bucks. All right, you got a hand tool kit, storage case. Uh, this is really basic tools, 14.99. You got a heavy duty clamping multi purpose vise 106. You got another vise here at 93 bucks. And then you got that sold out. All right, you got some Milwaukee here under up to $200 off water filtration softening. Didn't we already go over this last time? So we already went over this last time. I don't know why Home Depot keeps bringing this up. All right, so that's it for today, guys. Um, I gotta say, some of these deals are okay. The Octanes are definitely the best deals on these. To tell you the truth, Octane is the way to go. But, you know, if you guys don't know, Octane is, is going away. They're bringing just new stuff in. It's crazy. So, I would definitely buy the Octane. And on these, I guess the Ryobi, this one's an okay deal. Uh, most of these are overpriced. Um, some of these are okay. Pretty good deal on these. Like, some mechanic tools are pretty good um these like i said definitely watch out for them if you guys want to watch some of my videos on these I, i've done a few of them already they i have a lot of companies that send me you know batteries like this and i test them i, I actually um i had run multiple tests like i'll drain I'll, I'll put stress on that battery i'll just keep uh starting it until it stresses out you know see what the stress level is on that like see how much stress it, it could take because um, some of these batteries, to tell the truth, either w with one or two cranks, they're already dead. Um, like the smaller, the smaller one that we were showing you guys, like, like something like this. If you if you start a V8, it'll just, you know, it'll just die within like two or three cranks. A bigger battery, a bigger battery. Um, I like I said, I have some twenty thousand MAs. Those things will, will they will take a lot of beating, and they won't heat up. So anyways, that's it for today. Don't forget to help out the channel by subscribing, hitting the like, hitting the bell icon. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Thank you for